Flower the skunk is so incredibly charming, it's easy to forget what a smelly little creature she really is. Hey, sweetie. She's not even smelly anyways. We actually descented them um, when they were a few months old. So uh, with skunks, the really stinky stuff that they spray at you actually just comes out of their anal glands. So we removed both of those so they can't spray. The skunks, just like ferrets or other weasels and stuff like that, will always have sort of a, a smell or an odor to them that's a bit musky. Hey, sweetie. You're okay. Zoo veterinarian Charlene Bergvins and vet tech Megan Desai are here to give Flower her vaccination today, and as always, she is sweet as pie. Okay. We were just vaccinating them, just doing their routine vaccines. Skunks in Manitoba are known as one of the major vectors for rabies, so we vaccinate them for rabies, and then we also vaccinate them for some of the routine diseases that domestic cats get, because they're, they're similar in cats to, to the diseases that they get. Oh, sore bum. Flower's sister Stella, however, is a bit more standoffish. Stella, the one who was found on the second day, has always been um, a little bit more skittish around us, and when she first came in, she was really sick. She had a pneumonia and she wasn't doing very well and so we had to get her on antibiotics really really fast. Whereas Flower, I think, you know, we found her a day before and she definitely didn't have the struggles that Stella had. Flower's always been the bigger one, the bossier one who takes over the food and will push Stella out. Um, so Flower's always been the more outgoing one and Stella's always been a little bit more nervous. She's more nervous today than she has been over the last few weeks, and I think that's just because they were put in this enclosure just a few days ago. So I'm hoping if we spend some more time with her, Stella will get more comfortable with us again. Dr. Berkvins will come out and hang with the girls another day so they both feel comfortable around people. Skunks are pretty cool critters, and they deserve a visit from you next time you're at the zoo. Next week on Zoo Hospital, Simon the Fox fails miserably at his training session. But he's darn good at jumping on stuff like this box. Don't miss all the box bouncing fun next week on Zoo Hospital.